to check the facts. This is an upload of one of my old videos because I didn't like how I did it and the quality wasn't so great. I'm stepping outside of the politics for this video and covering the topic of grammar. Politicians, celebrities, important people, most of them make this one mistake that to anyone who knows grammar feels like nails on a chalkboard. This is something that should have been mastered in the fifth grade at the latest. It is none other than I versus me. So I just want to take a minute and a half to teach you something so basic as I versus me. I is used rampantly by people and they think they sound so smart. I've even seen people in interviews cock their head in a very snobbish way thinking that they said something amazing and smart and they're so intelligent. So the next time someone thinks that they're intelligent, you could show them that they're not because you actually are. So, how can you tell when you use I or me in a sentence? Kelly talked John and I into staying. Kelly talked John and me into staying. A lot of you are probably going to choose the first one. Kelly talked John and I into staying. Let's see how this works out. Take away John and and read it again. Kelly talked I into staying. Kelly talked me into staying. Don't get mad. You just learned something. I'm not kidding. People don't even know this. Basic grammar. Lewis and I went to the store. Lewis and me went to the store. Take out Lewis and and you get I went to the store or me went to the store. Obviously, it's I went to the store. The assistant talked to Jane and I. The assistant talked to Jane and me. There are so many people I have heard use this at the end of a sentence, the name of a person, and then I. Take off Jane and, and you get the assistant talked to I, the assistant talked to me. If only they knew, they would feel like fools. The item was given to Kenny and I as a gift. The item was given to Kenny and me as a gift. Take off Kenny and, and you get the item was given to I as a gift or the item was given to me as a gift. Hopefully you guys are getting the hang of this because it's pretty easy. They told John, Andrew, and I that we couldn't go over there. They told John, Andrew, and me that we couldn't go over there. Take off John, Andrew, and, and you get they told I we couldn't go over there or they told me we couldn't go over there. Second one, obviously. The books were for Kelly and I. The books were for Kelly and me. Take off Kelly and, and you get the books were for I or the books were for me. Pretty simple. It was obvious Lisa and I did not understand. It was obvious Lisa and me did not understand. Take off Lisa and and you get it was obvious I did not understand or it was obvious me did not understand. Obviously, it's the first one. Last one. They talked to John and I about this or they talked to John and me about this. Take off John and and you get they talked to I about this or they talked to me about this. There you have it. Basic grammar. Why did I choose to do this topic? Because people sound so irritating and so bad when they can't get something right that they should have learned as children. There's no excuse excuse for something like this. Some of you will think this is so dumb. Well, hopefully you leave a little bit smarter. If you like my videos, please subscribe. Make sure your notification is on so you know when I upload a new video. Leave a comment below and give me a like if you thought this video was helpful. Educate yourself!